Hello once again. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Now let's provide solution. Square root of x over x is equal to a five. Okay. Here we can write this one as by copy. Let's ex a copy what we have. Square root of x over x equal to a five. Okay. Let's put common denominator here, then make cross multiplication. This is equal to square root of x equal to 5x, right? Then by squaring both sides, okay, this one will go to get x which is equal to 25 x squared <coughs> okay or well, we can write this one as 25x squared minus x which equal to 0 right then x by factorizing x to get 25 x minus 1 which equal to 0 right then x will be equal to 0 or 25x will be equal to 1, right? Here, 25x will be equal to 1 by 25 by 25. Then x here will be equal to 1 over 25. Okay? To me that here, have x equal to 0 or 1 over 25. Let us check. Make sure that the solution you have, you are going to plug in the above formula you have been given. If you have given equation square root of x over x is equal to 5, to mean that here we have x each is equal to 1 over 20, 1 over 25, then square root, okay, over 1 over 25. We are going to see if it is equal to, to, is equal to 5, okay? Then this, we can write this one equal to square root of 1 over square root of 25, over 1 over 25 right this equal to square root of 1 is equal to 1 over square root of 25 is equal to a 5 then over 1 over 25 right then here this is equal to 1 over 5 then times 25 over 1, right? 1 over 5 times 25 over 1, this will be equal to 25 over a 5, which is equal to a 5. To mean that our first solution is true. Right? By checking second equation, second solution, sort of x over x, which is equal to a 5, this will bring square root of a 0 over a 0 is equal to 5. Right? Then square root of 0 is equal to 0. Then by cross multiplication, it will be equal to a 0. Right? So our solution is correct to mean that our x is equal to 0 or x is equal to 1 over 25. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share and subscribe.